Okay, hey guys, so I know I said I wouldn't be back for a while, but I'm just going to do... Well, I flatter my hair every day, and people keep asking me how I flatter my hair, so... Uh, this is what my hair looks like um, before I flat iron it. It's pretty straight, as you can tell, but I like it to be stick straight, so... Um, what I do is I section it off, so I get, like, the top half of my hair. Just get, like, any little claw clip it, clip it up. Um, I use a cheap flat iron. I actually don't put in any heat protectant spray in my hair. Um, a lot of people will say to use heat protectant spray. The only reason I don't is because I don't really like putting products in my hair, like, more than I need to. So, but if you have, like, hair that, um, and on my hair is pretty straight, so my flat iron isn't on my hair for very long, because I don't really need to straighten it that much. But, if your hair requires, um, a longer time, then... I would probably use heat protectant spray. Okay, so what I do is I clip it up, and this just kind of helps you um, make sure all your hair gets like more even contact with the iron, rather than trying to do the full thickness of your hair at once. Then a lot of your hair is not going to touch the iron, and so it's not going to be that flat. And so this will help lay it straight. So I just grab a piece, and I just pull it through. I wish there was more to this than that, but like I said, my hair is pretty straight. I don't really need to straighten it that much. Then I'm done with half of the bottom. <coughs> but I usually just like run my hands through really quickly once and then just you can use a comb or whatever too. And that just kind of makes the hair um, go into the iron smoothly. See? It's really not. I really wish there was like more to it than this. But I mean, you'd be surprised how many people ask me how I flatter my hair. But I just have naturally pretty straight hair. It's just that since I have what are called long layers, um, I mean my hair isn't like perfectly stick stick straight, you know? So these top layers usually don't rest perfectly on top of um, my longer layers. Like do you see this how this like goes out a little bit? Yeah, it's not perfectly straight, but it's pretty straight. But I want it to be like perfectly straight. So these are my top layers. See how like my hair looks shorter all of a sudden? It's like an instant haircut. <laughs> See it? Just pull through. There's really not a whole lot to this, I must say. If I'm not talking and explaining this, I can do this in like a minute. My whole head. So that's why another reason I just don't use heat protection spray because I'm really not flat ironing my hair for that long. Um, it, however, if your hair isn't straight, I would straighten my hair more like you know, grab a piece and make it go like down, down, down. <coughs> Sorry, <coughs> allergies. That's crazy. And that usually is a little bit better. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Not anything too crazy, right? <laughs> And I mean, I've been doing this to my hair, no heat protecting spray for, you know, <coughs> since I was 14. And I've never really noticed any damage or anything. There you go. That's pretty much it. I know. Complicated. Okay, anyways. So I hope that answers your guys' questions that asked um, how I fire my hair. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.